case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In a gripping 2000 court case, Barnett v. State, addressed by the Alabama Court of Criminal Appeals, a complex and contentious legal point was debated. If a lethal assault resulted in the victim's death, would such an act merge into the killing, thus preventing a charge of felony murder using assault as the underlying felony? The case echoed with the echoes of a chilling incident involving Andre Barnett and Kevin Moses. Barnett found himself on the wrong side of the law, slapped with a 50-year prison sentence for his actions that led to Moses' death during a skirmish. The crux of the case lay on an essential point. Could Barnett, who claimed on appeal to have been charged for assault, not felony murder, be indicted validly with the heavier felony? This question unsettled the justice seekers since assault was considered the underlying felony. The court's examination of the case led them back to where it all began. Barnett and his mate, Morris Givens, had visited Daphne Golson's home hoping to pick up Givens' daughter. An altercation erupted between Givens and Golson, leading to a face-off between Moses and Barnett. Tragically, Moses was struck down by a garden hoe wielded by Barnett, which claimed his life. Fueling the controversy, the court's verdict revealed an indictment flaw. Barnett's charge sheet, replete with felony murder accusations, should instead have constituted assault charges. By virtue of this precedent-setting truth, a groundbreaking rule was established. Incidents of fatal assault could not prop up the felony murder rule unless a third party lost their life, they ruled. This seismic shakeup in legal interpretation rendered Barnett's indictment invalid, stripping the court of jurisdiction to pass judgment. Consequently, Barnett's judgment was reversed, and a retrial was declared to be in order. Any unaddressed arguments during this process were considered inconsequential and cast aside, courtesy of the pivotal nature of this resounding court decision. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.